I'm Jimmy Lewis with Jimmy Lewis Off-Road and today we're going to talk about balance. Balance is crucial on a two-wheeled vehicle and you may have been riding for one day or a hundred years and you can still learn a lot by doing this drill. It relies a lot on muscle memory and it's teaching yourself how important balance is. So what I have my bike sitting here, the side stands not down and I'm just going to basically teach myself what it feels like to keep this bike in balance. In the beginning I'm going to hang on to the handlebars, not very tight. I'm making sure my bike's balanced and what I'm going to do is just go stand up on the pegs just like this and I'm making this look a lot easier than it is because I practice this a lot. So I go stand up, I start losing my balance, I put my foot back down to the side the bike wants to fall. So again stand up, balance, balance, foot goes down to the other side. That was a long time. Seems easy, let's make it a little more difficult. Now I'm going to take my hands off the handlebars and stand up go back down, stand up, go back down. That way I'm doing a lot of the balancing with my feet and that's really important. If you start using your hands on the handlebars, you treat it like a push-up and a pull-up bar, you're going to get tired. This is a drill that you can pretty much do any place. You could do it in your garage as long as you have enough room in case you tip over, you don't get tangled up and stuff. So again, you're just practicing being balanced. You can do it sitting as well. So I'm going to do it sitting down. So I've got the bike balanced, I'm picking my foot up, the bike leans the other side, I put my foot back down. If you're challenged by the seat height of the motorcycle, you can also bring your butt off to the side when you start to lose your balance, like this. Be careful you don't get hooked up on the foot pegs, because then if the bike tips over and you can't get your leg out, there could be a problem. Again, it's just practicing your balance, and that plays on your muscle memory. And you have no idea how this starts developing in your riding, so when you start losing your balance, even in the slight bit, you know what it feels like and you can react to it. And when you're riding, it's often with a little bit of throttle or some clutch control to get the bike back into balance as well as using a little bit of your muscles. You wanna be as loose as possible and you wanna use your legs and not your hands. They can assist you, but you don't wanna rely on them. To practice is to take a wooden stake and just stand on it as if it were your foot pegs. It'll teach you about proper riding position. You practice balancing on the stake and staying comfortable. That way you don't have the handlebars to rely on and you'll figure out what is a normal natural position. Get tired, you're doing it wrong. And trust me, this is not a natural proper riding position. For more off-road riding tips, check us out at jimmylewisoffroad.com. Or if you want to be a much better rider, come out and see us at our school. See you on the trail.